What is fatal familial insomnia? Imagine a world where you can never sleep again. No matter how tired you are, your brain refuses to shut down. Fatal familial insomnia, or FFI, is a rare genetic brain disorder that affects sleep. It happens because of a change in a specific gene, which causes certain proteins in the brain to fold incorrectly becoming toxic. These misfolded proteins build up in the thalamus, the part of the brain responsible for regulating sleep, causing severe, untreatable insomnia. Over time, this area stops working, and people with FFI lose the ability to sleep entirely. Because you need sleep, the rest of your body begins to shut down, affecting functions controlled by the parasympathetic nervous system, which is responsible for calming the body and helping it relax. This leads to symptoms like ataxia, difficulty with movement and balance, confusion, memory loss, and other issues related to the body's inability to rest and repair properly. FFI is a very rare disease, affecting only 1 to 2 people per million worldwide. It is inherited in an autosomal dominant pattern, meaning if one parent has the mutation, there is a 50% chance they will pass it down, and the child will inherit the mutation and develop the disease. FFI symptoms usually begin between the ages of 20 and 61, with an average onset around 50 years old. FFI progresses quickly as the thalamus degenerates. The disease progresses in four stages with the typical duration from onset of symptoms to death is 18 months. Stage 1, 3 to 6 months, difficulty sleeping, vivid dreams, panic attacks, and paranoia. Stage 2, 5 to 9 months, worsening insomnia, mood changes, anxiety, and movement issues. Stage 3, about 3 months, complete inability to sleep, hallucinations, and severe physical decline. Stage 4, up to 6 months, dementia, speech problems, coma, and eventually death. There is no cure for fatal familial insomnia. Diagnosis involves genetic testing, brain scans, and sleep studies. A diagnosis of fatal familial insomnia is devastating to the person and their loved ones. However, it is important to understand that the earlier the diagnosis is made the earlier the treatment of symptoms can begin. A diagnosed patient will likely remain in palliative care and take sleep medications, such as benzodiazepines, since treatments only help manage symptoms rather than cure the disease. Depending on the individual's symptoms, antidepressants, antipsychotics, and muscle relaxants may also be prescribed. A diagnosed patient and their family can also participate in psychotherapy, or counseling, to cope with this devastating diagnosis. Due to the fatal nature of this disease it is important to discuss end-of-life care. Fatal familial insomnia is a devastating and rare disorder, but ongoing research aims to find potential solutions. Scientists are exploring treatments such as gene editing, prion-targeting drugs, and other therapies that may help slow disease progression or alleviate symptoms. While there is currently no cure, continued advancements in medical research offer hope for future treatment options. If you found this video helpful, consider sharing it to spread awareness. Thanks for watching.